I'm here on a quest to try and find Raj, David Walliam's most beloved character. Now, he features in quite a lot of David Walliam's books. However, we think he's gone a bit AWOL because he's only been featured in the introduction to Walliam's most recent book, World's Worst Children. Having previously been one of the main stars, we can kind of see why he must be so offended. So I've come here to see if I can find Raj and explain to him why David Walliams couldn't give him his pride of place the normal way. I've also come to deliver this huge stack of fan mail from Raj's many young admirers. Who knows, I might even get a personal thank you from David Walliams. Well, I've seen the manager of this shop and I think it just might be Raj. I've even brought some of his fan mail to show that the world still loves him. And, well, it's David Walliams' fault he's not in World's Best Children. Wish me luck! Hello. Oh. What are you doing here? Oh, I'm just seeing if anything's past the sell by date. What do you mean, sell? Just like if they're out of date. Did you see anything wrong here? No. No? So what? I was just checking if they're past the Don't rubbish talking with me. Get out from here. Get out. Get out. Get out now. Well, that went well. So, I walked into the shop and I was thinking this just might be Raj's shop. Hi, um, How are you? I'm good, thanks. Um, Daily shorts? Yes, please. That will be 70 pounds, darling. Yeah, could I quickly ask you a question? At my school, I'm getting, I mean, my friend is getting, um, like, bullied by another girl at our school and she's not really that keen on it so we were wondering if anyone around here had any advice. Yeah, we're not singling out random news agents or anything. No, we're just um yeah, we're just asking around if anyone has any any advice for her, yeah. Yeah. I walked up to him and I bought some jelly tots as a diversion. While he was giving me heaps of advice, whereas well, Raj only gives one sentence, so it probably wasn't uh, him, but I started looking at the dates around the suites nearby. I checked the cream eggs, but they were in date with ages to go. I also checked the Murray Mints, but they were still just in date. So it probably wasn't Rogers, because as we all know, he never has anything that is slightly edible in date. Well, that will be all. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, anything else? Uh, no, that's it. <laughs> 70 pence, please, darling. That's the money. Thank you very much, indeed. Thank you.